Hi guys, I'm Chantelle Super and I'm going to be doing a what's in my hospital bag. I'm just going to cut to the chase because I didn't really know what to put in my bag. But here we go. I've got this little cardigan that my nan's next door neighbour knitted me. It's mint green. Matches one of the outfits that I've got her. That is, well, her dad got her. A newborn one and it's got mint green on the little baby grow. I've got a baby grow, a little sleeping outfit with like the long arms and long legs or whatever. And then I've got leggings in there, like I really didn't know what to pack because she's due in August. The babies aren't good with the heat, so I don't know what it's going to be like in a day either. So I just overpacked her so she had something. I've got zero to three month short sleeve baby grow. Um, my nan's neighbour is knitting a white cardigan as well, so it will go with her coming home outfit no matter what it is. Muslins, another newborn outfit. It's so hard because um, I had a scan, I can't remember what was it, oh, 30 something week scan, and they said that I was having a big baby, but I was thinking, how do you know, like what means if she stops growing or like something, so I don't know. She'll have something though. A blanket. I've got a wash bag, but I won't go through it. I've just got a dove wash in there, a wash for my face, toothpaste, toothbrush. I've got this little cool down spray. Bottoms up, Maria. Bottoms up spray to spray down there to afterwards. So it's going to help numb it, help the pain. A nursing bra, a little Tommy Tippy set, the hairbrush and all that in it. Because if she's anything like me and her dad, we had a lot of hair when we were born. So if she's got a lot of hair, sort of hair out. I need to sort mine out. I'm going to get braids. So I didn't pack any shampoo or anything, I won't need it. I've got a lounge bikini top because I want to have a water bath. These two little cuddly things, it's only to go in the pit, like for a picture. I know she's not gonna be holding it, but depending what outfit, this one goes to the mint green outfit, this for anything else. Hand sanitizer, nipple cream, money for the car park which i don't know if i have to bring like if i should bring another little bag because when i get to the car park i don't want to open carry on to get just the money out i don't know um the other side i've brought her nappies i've actually brought like a pack 10 i don't know how many i'll need maternity pads i've got from boots and that's that so i'm 36 weeks today and this is my bump she's dropped a little bit this is my birthmark but yeah so this is she for now if i've left anything out of my hospital bag comment below because i really didn't know what to put in it it was actually so much stress it's so overwhelming sometimes to like google it all and so many people putting different things in their bag and her being due in august it can be sunny one day and then cold the next so i didn't know what to pack but I'm so happy I've got one of these little white hats. I actually hate them red ones they give you. So hopefully I won't need a red one. I'm hoping to God. It reminds me I was in school play when I was younger. And my mum and dad forgot to pack me a hat for the play. And it made me wear this red bubble hat. And it's what it reminds me of. That's why I hate it so much. But if it does the job, it does the job. I've got a button down 90. 
that's from Boohoo, I think it's like £10. I went to Primark today and got this as my home outfit. Not that mine's important, but if it is hot, I don't want nothing tight, so I just got that from Primark. And it was £6. I should actually try this on to make sure the arms fit because I was size 8 and I've got a size 10. But, oh well. I'll probably pack a top, oversized top, and some joggers in case it's cold. So, pretty much what I'm wearing. But, um, and some sliders just so I can disinfect. And it's all over and done with. I really hope I'm not in there for a long time. But yeah, if you've got any suggestions, put them down below. Thank you for watching. Bye. Stay safe.